Yes, y'all, I am here for it today. Um, I have a wild hair up my ass. And there's nothing to do with it because we all under quarantine. So I'm in a, you know, what, what would normally be a really, you know, new and different thing for me to, you know, experience with this wild hair up my ass today. What would normally be a thrill, a super thrill, has now turned into frustration. This is how I talk when I'm frustrated, especially at these people on YouTube, because they're not worth, you know, any of all of this sweet energy what I oozes over here in this room. Y'all should see the flow. You can just lick the flow. It's just as sweet as sugar around here. Honey, everywhere, just dripping, oozing, all down, every crack of my body. But I got this wild hair up my ass today, and, the, and I'm under quarantine, so that poses a problem. So when I have a problem, guess who else is going to have a problem? You guessed it. Whoever I feel like well, I want to give my problem to today. Today, I'm going to give it to quite a few people. You know, I'm here for it. You know, honey is oozing and I don't have nobody to lick it off. And I can't lick it off for nobody else's ass today. So, you know, this wild hair, I guess it's just had to go up my ass because it wasn't nowhere else to go. But anyway... Apparently, I'm not the only one that has wild hairs. Except hers, hers has grown up into her brain. Because she has to be out of her mind to get on here and even think about saying the things that she says on here. Listen to her. I'm going to let y'all hear it for yourself. Hey, ladies. What is going on? We're just about to get to work, okay? Because... Now, is this the same person that was just, like, you know, geeked out in the car? <laughs> Why she look over there to the left like that? And then it's like she looking over her shoulder. <laughs> is she looking over her shoulder? She in this random man house. She probably looking over her shoulder. <laughs> Do you sleep with one eye open? Do you sleep in the daytime? <laughs> Y'all, I guess like this from time to time. These folks on here, see, because everybody gets a wild hair up their ass. And for, the, and, and for all you prim and proper ladies out there, yes, even your man gets a wild hair up his ass sometimes. And what that means is, that's going to be a time when he's going to do whatever the hell he want to do with who, with whoever he want to do it with. He's going to break it off. You know. Somebody going to get some. It won't be you. You know. Just accept it. Men get these wild hairs up their ass. You know. And all of us do it. All of us. Never forget that. Now. You know. And to see such. You know. And I don't know. I don't, I don't know what it is about me and YouTube. For, you know. Folks know they stays bothering me up on here. I have from day one. Folks been bothering me. It's not as bad as it used to be. I can tell by the comments because the comments I used to have to go searching for good comments and then after I got tired of looking I would just disable the comments altogether. Now I have to go searching for the assholes that try to sneak in a little read in there and sometimes I get it confused because in one breath it's almost like well 
okay, well, I'm glad I saw this other one that you left because I, now I know that you're trying to act like you like me, but really you don't like me. Are you the one that's like subscribing and us? <laughs> Let me tell y'all what they doing, y'all. <laughs> it's somebody that's sitting around and they clicking subscribe or subscribe. <laughs> And my right hand, my right hand is up in the air. It's pointed to the side, though. I'm not going to point it up in the air all straight up. Because there ain't nothing straight about that. Somebody is sitting around clicking subscribe, uh, subscribe, subscribe. <laughs> subscribe, uh, subscribe. <laughs> If I didn't see it in real time, I would not believe it. <laughs> My subscribers kept changing from five to six. Five to six. Five to six. <laughs> I had to get my magnifying glass make sure I was able to see straight. Now, who would do such? I wonder. <laughs> you know what? Pick any of my 52 cards. <laughs> Cause I got 52 haters. With 52 troll accounts each. <laughs> ah, have mercy. Do y'all like it when I come on here and just cut up with y'all? See, I have a I have a wild hair up my ass. I can't tell y'all what that really means. I feel so we have been very lazy dealing with this motherfucker. <laughs> she looking by. She checking behind her head. It's the man. It's the man. It's the. It's the <laughs> Who is the man? Do you how well do you know this this gentleman? You know this gentleman that you claim that was eating your coochie? <laughs> he must have been mighty damn hungry. You really look like you are really see that just goes to show y'all, you know, looks are deceived. <laughs> In this case, if y'all see a beater headed looking helpful. Well, I cut her eyes at you. Believe me. <laughs> she up to something. And she then just became up to something. She doesn't always up to something. She don't like me and they stay bothering me on here. They, you know, they bothers me so around here on these... <clears throat> I don't know. Do they think I'm, I might get a donation? But somebody did ask me to do the PayPal. To be honest with you, I don't even want to do that. Because, you know, I really don't want to put my information out there. Because they might start trying to, you know, send fake subpoenas to, to PayPal. <laughs> <clears throat> but... Honest and truly, though, I've never seen a beady eyed and heifer, you know, like in slow motion, like where I can just pause it and just really look. You know, if you look, it's almost like she has um, the kind of vision where she can see all across that room, no matter no matter which way her eyes is pointing. <laughs> Even though her eyes is pointing this way, she can still see what's going on on the other side of that room. And see her mouth her mouth says a lot. You know. <laughs> that's a look she that's a look she gave Big Red when she found that other woman information on his phone. <laughs> he knew he couldn't sleep that night. He had to hide all the knives in the house. <laughs> They can't be trusted when they get like this, y'all. See, this is how they get when, like, on that, like, we'll just say maybe once a month, some guys twice a month, 
some guys once a week. Sometimes some guys two or three times a week get a wild hair up their ass. I'm not gonna tell y'all how often I get a wild hair up my ass, but let's just say I stay scratching my ass because I always have a wild hair up my ass. You know. For a wild boy. I love a wild boy. Or a, or a boy that will let me do wild things to him. But this is the look that they give you. When they antennas tell them that. You know. You you have. A wild hair up your ass time of the month. A lot of them. You know, see, she needs to loosen this ball. <laughs> yeah, stop the blood flow. <laughs> she can't think straight. Even when she take it off because it's been on there so long. So when she sleeps, it's like her brain. You know how most people's brains, it's like it processes the data for, for that day when you're sleeping. Hers, it's like it's going back. So, you know, February the 23rd. <laughs> Every day she wake up. She be, she be hoping and praying she in a nightmare. No, I'm not going nowhere. Not yet. You know. <laughs> That's what's bothering her ass. Take a look at her. Y'all listen to her. Watch, watch her mouth and her eyes. Try not to worry about this, you know, this soup bowl <laughs> on top of her head. <laughs> ah. See, they got, it's a corkscrew. See, she got this thing wrapped around that corkscrew. That, see, that corkscrew going down into her skull. <laughs> she couldn't get it out because Big Red say no way to hell. You coming out to me like this. So he had to, you know, go on and do what he had to do, you know. So that's why she's, you know, she keeps that thing on, you know, until that place healed in her head. You know, it ain't healed yet. <laughs> Did you stab that girl? Wasn't this a girl you cut? I heard you said I heard you talk about like how you had cut that girl, and then you know like like you know like when y'all were you know like like when y'all was childs and stuff, cause you had cut that girl. Either you stabbed her or you cut her or something. And then I think after y'all became grown, then you came. Then you know you felt bad. <laughs> she felt bad twenty years later and came and apologized. And they had a sit down. I think they friends now. But anyway, y'all, let's hear what she's up to. Suck on stupid two k. <laughs> I don't even like when she said, <laughs> look how her eyes change when she said my name. <laughs> There's a glare. <laughs> It's all like she's looking at you, but it make you. <laughs> Can y'all see that? I'm going to open this up bigger. I want y'all to look at this. Look at the way her eyes is. When she even said my. <laughs> Look at don't do that. Don't care also. And why do you bother me so the way you do? <laughs> I'm scared. <laughs> you got me scared over here. And my stomach <laughs> I can't even do the commentary. Of what I came on here to do, cause I was gonna, I was gonna semi drag somebody, but I decided <laughs> there's more urgent things to tend to right now. Now, don't this say love? 
you know, and the little. <laughs> Somebody like this, she'll get she'll get all dressed up in pink. You know, she'll get pretty in pink <laughs> with black widow intentions. <clears throat> anyway, I I you know I've heard this once. It went in one ear, not the other ear. I'm gonna I'm gonna break it down where everybody can understand. You know, as if your look doesn't speak. You know. A trillion words. <laughs> you know what, y'all? If y'all walking, if y'all walking down the street, if y'all out in public somewhere at the mall, at a restaurant, or you know, just you know, maybe even just walking on the beach. <laughs> if the wave wash up something like this, and you standing over it, and they open their eyes, and they open their eyes and look up at you like this. Believe me, it was planned. It wasn't just circumstance. It was planned. Well in advance. See, this is the kind of heifer, you know, will hide in your bushes at your front door. At night. You know, even throughout, even throughout the coronavirus. <laughs> But what scares me is that it's that glare that you have. <laughs> it's almost like you're looking right at me. And you just mentioned my name. Why would you call my name? My name is not stuck on stupid. He's sleep right now. <laughs> he he's somewhere dreaming about a boy. So anyway, I don't know, you know. I understand B I G R E D D is gone. It ain't nothing I can do for you. Miss Thing. <laughs> Miss Out Your Mind Thing. Hey, now, okay. <laughs> you see how she's looking for out of here? What's she looking for out <laughs> If y'all see somebody keep looking behind their head, Believe me, they have been on the other side of that. They have came up behind somebody before. Okay? Best believe that. They have. Boy, y'all stay bothering me. Y'all love. I, and listen, I have a question. Why do y'all bother me so the way y'all do? Huh? That's all I really want to know. Maybe I should come back to that. Let's come back to that. Let's come back to why y'all bothers me so the way y'all do. Because I want to address something. Now, y'all, I have to look now and, and, and find these find these comments. Somebody had, a, had something snide to say. The reason I know what it is is because I didn't give it no kind of thumbs up or nothing. That's why it's easy to find them. It, now, in the days of Trey King, all of my comments would be flooded with his madness and Zillionaire's madness. Now it's to the point where I have to go searching for the bad comments now. So I don't know. I don't know how this stuff works anymore. But anyway, y'all, this is what we see. So we can hold it. We can spam it. You know, we have complete control of these things. They don't want y'all to know this. Believe me, if y'all left a comment, they know about it. <clears throat> now, I guess these I haven't responded to yet. But somebody left a left a snide comment, and the reason I know is because it's the one it's one that I did not give it give it um, a thumbs up. Now. This this girl that I just did the video on, you know, this this female. Now, if I dragged you mistakenly, it's your own fault. Because you don't come on here and say to me. Because, I mean, that's like coming in my house and what? 
you know, sitting down and I didn't even really even let you in the house. You know what I'm trying to say? And the problem I have is that, you know, <clears throat> I don't know if I should have dragged you or not. At this point, I can't care because it's been done. And but I mean, but you know, I didn't drag you far. I just dragged you from the house to the road. I didn't drag you up and down the street. But you know, y'all have to be clear in your comments. You know, and then you can't be wishy washy. You can't be. See, here it is. Now, here I thought you were being funny here, cause I, cause I read one of these, and then so I thought you were like on my team. You see, I thought you were on my team because you were funny here. And then something happened and you flipped. You flipped and then you said something that I did not like. And so I had to address you. But that's the only reason I addressed you. If you hadn't left that last comment, you should have just left an emoji. And then that way I, you know... I can just respond back with an emoji if I don't know what you're talking about. Like, you know, the question mark, I'll do that. But it's something else that you said, and I've already addressed you on a video. Ho, oh, you know, uh, so I don't know what else to say. But basically, somebody left something, and I really want to address you whether you have a channel or not. You know, and I tries to be nice to y'all folks. I, I enables these comments, but y'all find that as a crack to come in and abuse some kind of way. And that's why, you know, I'm never going to put these comments on lockdown again. I'm just going to have to start dragging y'all ass. You know, I suggest you come in under your troll account, like Zillionaire Entertainment does, and Trey King. But did, did, did I ever tell y'all that Trey King came in under his real ID and exposed another channel of mine that I have? And I guess he was, you know, doing something really... I'm just filling in, y'all, while I do this. I guess he was doing something like... I guess I was being exposed. Do you know how Sakina goes around and find a channel that I already got advertised on my main channel and say, ooh, you know... He's been exposed now. And it makes you wonder who has time to go in and expose something that has already been exposed. And it was never a secret. I mean, I, I don't keep nothing from y'all except my identity, what I look like, where I live. <laughs> the business I'm in. The friends I have. Who I like on here. Who's big B-L-A-C-K-D that I want on here. Y'all would never know that. <clears throat> but it's not, <clears throat> I can tell you one thing, excuse me. I talk so much. <clears throat> I can tell you one thing, it's not big B-I-G-R-E-D-D, -D, that's for sure. But somebody has something to say. You better hope I don't find what you had to say. Now, a lot of times, sometimes y'all come in and leave stuff that it don't apply to that comment. But all comments are welcome, even the assholes too. At, but, you know, leave a comment at your own risk. Because, you know, there are, there's a very strong, you know, not opportunity. There's a very strong opposition to me doing this, you know. And I will do it on another person's channel too. So don't think that this is the only place that I will do this. I will go to I will go to the source of the channel where you're talking shit about me and bring up that comment and or that chat or whatever it is and then I will have to handle you, you know. In such a way to say, you know, I don't know why y'all bothers, bothers me the way y'all do. It's, are y'all trying to get under my skin? Is that what's going on? You know, because I have very thin skin. You know, it's very thin. Some of y'all claim to have 
thick skin on here, but you're getting your feelings so easy. All I got to do is just have an opinion about you and you in your feelings, you know. Um, and see, I didn't say nothing about that. She said, I'm very confused. Trey is very, yeah, he's a varied person, yeah. One minute he did that he this and then he showing y'all that and then he making y'all think this and then he telling y'all to do this and keep y'all foot on my neck that. But I don't watch any of those guys, you know. I mean, I bore easy. I bore very easy, you know. They don't, either you have it or you don't with me. Certain people can just get on here and just ride or, you know, walk or, you know, mumble or sleep or whatever. And I've, if I want to watch you do that, I'm going to do it. And ain't nobody going to stop me from doing it. But, you know, some of y'all just get on here and I'm, I'm like, damn, you know, did y'all bump y'all head when y'all <laughs> was a child? I have to ask myself this, you know. Um... Now, I don't know who this <laughs> is right here. But, you know, well, everybody's welcome, y'all. All are welcome. But somebody left something I did not like. But I have to ask myself sometimes if y'all, if you know, if y'all bumped y'all head when y'all was a child, you know. I mean, I fell off a stool. I was a rambunctious child. I fell off a stool and bumped my head. But... Well, actually, it was more than that. I had to go to the emergency room. But <clears throat> I'm just wondering, you know, y'all couldn't have bumped y'all head. I don't know. I'm just, it just had, it, it has me wondering that y'all get enough attention. You know, I understand this is a stage and everything, but at a certain point, you know, you do have to realize that, you know, the curtains will close, you know. A lot of y'all are living this 24 hours a day, seven days a week, 365 days a year. Okay, I think this is it. Well, no, I gave him a thumbs up, though. Maybe that wasn't it. If I can't find it, I'm coming back to you. Okay, just so you know it. If I can't find it. So... I suggest when y'all come on here and do y'all dirt and all that stuff, y'all need to be on the y'all troll accounts, you know, or you're at risk of, you know, me going through, you know, making small talk with my subscribers, you know, my core subscribers, you know, the ones that don't sit there and go subscribe, unsubscribe, subscribe, unsubscribe, subscribe, unsubscribe, and that's how I know you know, the fact that, I mean, I know I have two people on, well, no, three, no, four, no, five, I don't know, I've lost count. I have quite a few people bothered on here, you know, I, I don't know, maybe they're not used to my kind, maybe they, you know, have never really sat up and listened to my kind, but then, you know, at the same time, they don't have sense enough to know that I'm one of a kind. You know, um, but yeah, somebody had something to say. I I didn't give it a thumbs up, and that's how I know. And they said it. They thought it slipped through the cracks. It never slips through the cracks. That's not the one I was talking about, but. I guess I have to really, um, I guess I need to listen to what somebody say on here, don't I? Because somebody was trying to warn me about something. But at least he said, God, you know, God bless. He said, fall back, though. I didn't like that. You know, where am I supposed to fall back to? Ain't nobody going to catch me. It ain't like it's some big B-L-A-C-K-D that my mouth can fall on round up on these YouTube streets that I would ever tell y'all anything about. No. <clears throat> I 
You know, a lot of people have a lot of thoughts. Sometimes it only takes one person to really say what they think about something, and then other people realize, hmm, you know what, I think I think the same thing that that person right there think. As long as I stand behind them and, you know, don't never take none of the, you know, um, grunt of nothing, I'll just stand behind this person. Yeah, you know, I believe whatever it is that you think is best. Yeah, and they come over here and, they, and you know what? And they really, and it's like to me, they will go somewhere else and pray for Trey King. For, for, for some reason, here it is, right here. This is your ass. I found your ass. Whether you got a channel or not. See, when they do this, they have done something. You see this? Oh, wait a minute. I thought they had, I thought they had did something slick. This is it right here. This is them. <clears throat> and they talking about them. You know. I mean, that makes sense. Zulu. And he looking for fool fools. So, I mean, you know, I can't take that from you. I'm going to have to let you have that. But I am going to read the comment and then we're all going to have a laugh at how brainwashed you are. I will do that. But I'm not going to take that from you. He's probably the only thing you got left in this world. You know. The quack authority. Yeah. So apparently I'm another hating ass, clout chasing, jealous jackass. You also don't know what the F you're talking about. Really? Okay. If you say so. I didn't know I was a hating ass, clout chasing, jealous jackass. I mean, you know, you almost as good as I am. Miss Zulu. Because I'm thinking you got to be a woman. Ain't no way a man that's in their right mind gonna have all that to say about me but let's see I don't know who you are what you are where you are when you've been on here and how many tons you got up Jason Black's ass okay you need to pull one of them out okay This is somebody, uh, Zuzus. I don't know who you are, what you are, where you are, you know, why you want to come from me. I don't know. It seems like to me you might be related to somebody else. But let's get back to this, y'all. Let's hear her out. Now, it's, it's crazed people like this that will come on here and do things like this. The bolden ones. You know, the, you know, the dangerous ones. You know, with, you know, with razor blades all in their panties tied up all around their head. With corkscrews <laughs> in their skull. <laughs> yeah. And anytime they take that last draw of that cigarette, you know this is some serious, you know, they they are discussing some serious international YouTube business on these YouTube dirt roads around here. That's how you know. When it gets crucial like that, and you know, anytime they come on here with anytime they come on here like y'all y'all have heard of panties in a bunch. When they have their panties wrapped up around their head, too tight all around their forehead, making their ears stick out bigger than what they would normally stick out, you know this is important international YouTube business that they on here to tend to. And for that gal, if I dragged you incorrectly, I'll just have to take the L for that. But then, you know, I can't take 
the whole L. I'm just gonna take the L. Uh, because you should have known better than to come on here and call me a coward. And if you speak in two, uh, obviously you know how to talk in more than two words because you said something else that was funny. So, you know, be funny. Know that it was done in fun for a laugh. Be better than Bammy Bam. You know, don't be one of these hard rock nosed bitches on YouTube. You know. You know the kind you know the kind with no Fred Flintstone noses. <laughs> oh, a little old tar baby with a Fred Flintstone nose. Bless your heart. You can smell a donation a mile away, can't you? This is what Sakina is going to do. We will be going live tomorrow. But as we go live you mean you're gonna live on your other channel tomorrow like you live on this one like you live on youtube like you can't draw the line between reality and youtube is that why you were so mad at lovely because she took away your wrench you know those wrenches are imaginary those aren't real wrenches you can't unscrew that court screw out your skull with that wrench it's not real we're just going to do our homework, okay? YouTube homework? Okay. All right. Everybody got their pen and pad and, and, and uh, clipboard. <laughs> you got all your boots. Strap up your boots. We going to war. And why do y'all bother me like y'all do? Y'all the most bothering in this folks is on here. And for your mouth get like that, I know you don't mean nothing but just purity, just revenge, vengeance. You've been driven out of your mind over and over and over again. And I don't be trying to bother you. You just don't like that I like big B-L-A-C-K-D. And that you're by B-I-G-R-E-D-D. -D been coming in the back door. Uh, not only is we going to do our homework, we just... Yeah, you know what that means, don't you? See, y'all see that glare in her eyes? You know, it's it's almost like a glaze. <laughs> it's almost like her eyes is covered with, you know, like just dread. You know, dread. It's almost like she got like a transparent dread over her, over like her, the whites and the blacks of her eyes I don't know is that what the fiending and the geeking do and why your top lip don't never move everything else uh. <laughs> Why is you grinding up over there? Is that a rock on your <laughs> in between your fingernail? Them dirty rocks. You be carrying around them dirty rocks hid hid up under your nasty fingernails. That way he don't know what you got around there. I was And she gets so serious when she talk about me. <laughs> when she talk about me, she gets so serious. Why do you get so serious that way? It's not that. This is not real. <laughs> this is make-believe. We living in a make-pretend world on here. Have you ever walked down the YouTube streets? Okay. They don't exist. Dear. <laughs> <laughs> Please give Fred Fristone back his nose. <laughs> Ooh. And quit grinding your teeth at night and stuff.
able to find him. Yeah, I know you've been investigating and launching, you know, research teams and, you know, just doing too much. You know, really to tell you the truth, you're doing it all. And to look at you, you would think, you know, you would be someone that, you know, maybe a child could hold their hand, you know, and help them find their parents. Uh-uh. I don't think so. This URL number. I will show you how to find. Why would you want my URL number? I have a. I have a URL. <laughs> I didn't even know I had a URL number. I have a URL number. Really? Where would you get something like that from? And then you wonder why I don't want Google and YouTube to have my information on file. What is y'all really doing around here? Huh? That's what I want to know. What is y'all really up to? Is I'm in danger? Doesn't I... You... Because you have raised the price from $100 to $150. Is that a cold word for my head on a slab? You know, because you don't raised it up on this one. You raised it. His URL number to report him for... For what? Huh? What lie you finna tell on me? A bullying... Aren't you the bully on, on YouTube? I mean, you've been demoted now. I snatched off your panty hit rag. And I cut it two sizes too little to make sure your ass stay crazy on oh, yeah. And harassing. And you have to, you, even you have to close your eyes because you know those are lies. But you lied on Teresa Martin, though. So who who am I to think you would not lie on me? But that mouth don't never change. When that mouth, if y'all see anybody mouth, mouth like this, just know it's rage. It's it's contained rage that has built up. It's like a pressure cooker. <laughs> And the rubber don't wolf from around the pressure cooker. So all you hear is that water, you know, sp you know, spurring on that, on that, on that hot eye on that stove. That's what she is. The pressure is still on the pot, but it has spewed over into the eye on that stove. And she's trying to, like... Make it not make as much noise as it would normally make. <clears throat> okay. At yeah. And why? Why all of this over me? Why y'all bothers me like y'all do does and do, and always will. The bottom of your barrel. Talking about the crud that's been scraped up up under your fingernails, hunting rocks. Is that what it is? You need a hit before bed. Complete. And look at her. It's almost as if she's given, like, you know, in front of, like, you know, an auditorium of people. You is what. But now, talk American now. Going to put. Oh, okay. So see, she knows she knows how to how to you know carry on herself, you know, in a human like way. Every you know other quarter of the year. The Four times of the year, she know how to pronounce words. Video. Yeah. Mm hmm. Why your thumb so fat? 
like that and the inside of your other finger is brown and why you bend your thumb back like that you gonna break your thumb <laughs> the hell for her to break her thumb over here trying to get instructions on how to destroy me but yet she's sitting there and destroying herself okay you're good Oh, is that what they gonna do? They gonna do what you said do? Let's see what they let's see how many people had anything to say about this. Oh, seven people? What are they doing? I wanna yeah, this is this is who y'all, this is who have been this is who's behind all this. Look at that. See her? I'm going to have to do a special video on her ass. Let's get a good look at her, y'all. That's who's behind all of it. <coughs> and you know why she mad? Because I called her like, you know, some little old hood, hood, hood rat, ratchet tramp the other year who was a free for all for every boy in the neighborhood. And she was riding around in her mama car. You know, looking for somebody to stick up for weave. You know, all that fake hair around her face and all this other different stuff. And, you know, she just... You know, I really dragged her, like, in uh, probably about three minutes flat. She was dragged and then, you know, disintegrated. And she's been following me for, like, what? 18, 19, 20, 21 months now. And she, that's who Sakina is working with. When are you going to start donating to Sakina? Donate $150. You want that $150, don't you? Listen to her. Look at her. And look, y'all. They, you know what? And they don't never sleep, do they? She has to always edit her stuff because she be gonna call me all kind of things with her little, little trifling ratchet, heiferish ass, bald headed all around her face, looking like uh, somebody drawed her eyebrows on there with damn charcoal. That's, you know what, that's the ghetto version of a black widow. You know, it's men's now was on probation and got coke cases and everything else behind her lies, I'm sure. This is the culprit, y'all. This is her. This is, this is who has been after me. Did I open it up? This is who's been after me. See there? And you know what? And to think, you know what? Now, before all the plastic surgery and stuff, she probably was a pretty girl that had hair around, you know, right starting in the middle of her head back there. But I don't know, you know, her eyes, her head, all I see is forehead and all this other different stuff. She probably was a pretty gal at one time, you know, before the... You know, all the miscarriages and all these other different things. You know, these... Because they, they don't believe in birth control. They never have. You know. Ooh, I'll just go down to the clinic. You know. One of them kind of, you know, sweet, precious little old things around here walking around. Just as sweet as humble pie. Just as sweet as blackberry pie juice. On the second day. But this is what she really is about over here. Yes. See here. Look, look y'all. Look, look at her. And it bugs her. What happened? Did I suck your man's B I G B L A C K D, the one that you had 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 before? You had had his friend and his dad and his brother and his uncle too, and then nobody know who the baby daddy was. That one. 
Yeah, you that hoe. You that tricked out tramp hoe. But you don't took up with the wrong somebody. Don't you know I got 20 other channels, bitch? You know? I've been working you overtime. Without pay. Going on two years. I mean, are you wearing your mask and your gloves? And put some and put some petroleum jelly around your around your face for the all for all all that alopecia, all them tight little pink spots that that coronavirus can settle on and get into your bloodstream, ho. And take that stocking cap off your head and take that jiffy bag popcorn. Unpack them jiffy back popcorns and put one round. Matter of fact, just put one over your whole head. Matter of fact, just stay in the house with a big old jiffy pop popcorn bag around your damn face. Cause hold like you don't wear no panties. They've been towed and ripped and slashed off your ass. Because we know you like it rough. You want no rough, ratchet, tough, skank, skankish hoes from round away. You want no round away thoughts. A piece of a thought. You know, you ain't even a whole thought. You like, <clears throat> I'm that half a hole over there. Man, because I probably sucked your man whole big B-I, big B-L-A-C-K-D. Is that what's wrong? Is that what's got you mad? Because I told you that if your man was fine, he would break me off some. Or I would just get me some, some kind of way. Did that rub you the wrong way? You and your feelings behind that? You done shed at your weave over that. I told you about leaving all them strands I had all in the refrigerator, all in the bathtub, all in the car. Hell, he can't get out the front door from tripping over all that damn weave. Weave all in the milk. In the baby formula. You know, that's who behind it. I'm glad you finally came out of hiding, bitch. Skank, bitch. You know who you are. You one of them, you one of the skankishest, bitchesest. It is, it is. You want a damn. A black widow. Niggas find out about your ass. After they get out of prison, that's why your ass on the run. That's why you on YouTube. That's why you ain't post a damn video. It might not even be your picture. Knowing you. This, this is who you want to look like. A half a hoe. With makeup. You know. You want a mama, mama Sakina's cheerings. One of her skank skanks. To leave the, the link to the video, you're also going to track him down, get his information, stay up in shifts, research, investigate, work with Trey King and Zillionaire Entertainment and whoever else behind the scenes. And don't forget this old perpetrating skank down here. You know, the half of a whole, the half of a thought. Who's scared that that his that that, that her it's man, man's 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 before that might break me off half of his B L A C K D, and she bothered. Been in her feelings going on two years, over madness. I told y'all to leave them weeds and all them tight ass pants from around y'all heads. Y'all can't think straight. Y'all can't sleep at night. 
working for free trying to track down the untraceable person. Is y'all trying to find my middle initial? It's anywhere between A and Z. Uh, when you hear silence, y'all didn't see that video I made about the hunted. The hunter becomes the hunted. Did you see that? You. If this ain't you, somebody like you gonna have somebody like you with panties in a bunch all around their head. That's you know, but you need some panties around your head because your your forehead is too shiny and long, like a damn slide, a kid slide. Him say, Satina Terrellgood had. has had sex with a bisexual man who's been in prison for a total of five years. But she gets on here and lies and says that, you know, he's a straight man and that, you know, somebody from the prison would have called her and told her if he participated in anything like that. Now, how many of y'all have gotten that call? You know, that your man just busted a nut in prison. If that's what y'all waiting on, you know, y'all need to get off of YouTube. Snatch, chew. Yes, uh-huh. It came out of your own mouth, just like it did right then. Drink. Yes. You know, I mean, she can't be but so old. Is she one of them? That's what I'm thinking. Because she exhibits the same kind of like irrational, like insane, like unhinged, like enraged, like, you know, out of my mind, like in my feelings constantly, like, you know, do whatever it takes to find this nigga kind of behaviors of a woman a piece of woman raising a piece of thought is this one of your cheerings what was snatched snatched up in Cherry Hill New Jersey I think y'all working together. Matter of fact, I know it. You and Zillionaire and others. Okay, allow for them to know that times because of slander. He I mean, what? Y'all is working overtime trying to get my channel now. My channel that important to y'all folks. All I'm going to do is come on here and drag the hell out y'all ass when I come back. Don't y'all know that? And y'all bothers me so. A lot of insanity. What does Sakina have to say about this? Oh, look at her. She wants the Gmail. You know what? She wants that hundred and fifty dollars. And you can't spend it right now. You gonna catch the coronavirus around around your around your face, all them from all that ate out weave and 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 all this other different you know, alopecia yeah, and all that dandruff and stuff, all that caked up, scraped up dandruff, and all this different stuff. You need to you need to sanitize around your head, sanitize around your face. You willing to risk your life over a hundred and fifty dollars? Really? You need it that bad? What have I mean, really, what is it? You need an abortion or something? Come on, now. A news article, not no type of report to... 
Because there is none. This is the child right here. She has much housing syndrome. You the one that snatched her up. So she's under your influence. back up his claims of okay prove that you have not done it I mean I'm not the only one every time I turn around I'm seeing videos and hearing all these different things I didn't have anything to do with it <clears throat> I did a video on it just like everybody else did but this heifer right here here's the heifer right here y'all just her. And she looks to be a halfway of a normal of a thought. You know? And these polar guys, they get tricked into like, you know, donating, you know, becoming baby donors and all this other different stuff. Where all they can do is just sit around and get on welfare. And then these people like this are their role models what he is saying about me okay now for him to sit over there and say i done told all these lies on him i never said anything about the man okay not until he started talking about me it it does matter doesn't matter Addy. it does matter and why do you make that movement with your hand like across your throat like that <laughs> what does that mean <laughs> does that mean off with my head I mean, I already know that you are a knife master. You know, you pretty quick with them switchblades and razor blades and knives and stuff, ain't you? And she's your decoy. This is the setup, bitch. You know, see, a bitch like this will be the one that will set your ass up right here. And she's usually working for somebody like this, you know. It it take them about half a day, you know, for to get them printed like that. After they be in the in the thing and and, be, and they be sewing in all them different weeds and they, and and all this different stuff all into the all into their skin into their into their epidermal level and all this other different stuff and then all that stuff has to heal up they have to sanitize it and you know deodorize it and then you know pat it down and then make it blend in with their skin and then they have to blend in with what's left of the hair in the back of the middle of their head and <clears throat> it's all a ploy to set up a nigga this time that part it doesn't listen right now the only thing that i want to focus on is what what you want i'm scared <laughs> yeah she got me scared over here what is she trying to do over yonder <laughs> You know what, y'all? It's you know what now. I'm about, I'm about, I'm just gonna have to really call it what it is. They give black women a, a, a bad name. Her and this half of a her down here. This half of a ratchet thought her. She a effer. She ain't even a whole heifer. It's this shit getting him. Look how her eyes do. You look like you like from The Walking Dead. She's creepy. Isn't she creepy, y'all? Mm. Um, the fuck? <laughs> it's so crucial. Oh. Uh. Of making videos about me. Period. <laughs> Never! Ever! Heffa! <laughs> I like 
dragging ratchet thoughts though. I does. I does. Doesn't you like it when I doesn't when I does it? Put like period. Like I say, I will pay someone a hundred dollars to strike him. How about a hundred and fifty? Did y'all hear that? She might well be putting up her house. You know what I'm trying to say? It's that urgent for her. For her to come up off $150? That's like her putting up her house for you. For bail. Hundred and fifty to sh strike his page. Mm. Oh, I bet zillionaire after that money. You know what? You know nobody don't tell them what all they going on in the background for that hundred and fifty dollars. <laughs> I got a hundred and fifty dollar bounty on my head, y'all. That's ridiculous. How y'all bothers me like y'all do. <clears throat> y'all, how we gonna fight back? <clears throat> y'all gonna have to fight back for me on this one. If y'all want me to keep doing videos, y'all gonna have to handle this. Okay? We already know who that is. And this is who this is. Anybody recognize that woman? Y'all email and communicate with each other. Send out, send it out over, out over the whole social media. Y'all are going to have to put in the work, you know, to resolve this. Period. Exactly. Take it down. <laughs> I thought my channel did good. Thought my channel do good work right here. I get y'all music to get y'all mind off of the coronavirus. You know, I tell y'all all kind of uplifting things. I point out to y'all what a thought is because a lot of y'all don't know. Y'all be thinking it's hot, but it's actually a thought. You know, I reveal psychosis and, you know, mental illness and, you know, just all kinds of good things are going on over here. Why they want this channel down so like that? Why y'all bothers me like y'all do? And you doesn't stop. <laughs> y'all, I'm scared over here. I'm scared. Because if somebody come over here, see, it's going to be, really, it's not going to be good for them. I advise y'all not to do that. I highly advise you not to. He has to go. Says who? Y'all listen to how arrogant she is. You have to give me your money. You have to donate. He has to go. I want him gone. I mean she's talking like she is um that guy from the Godfather or something, isn't she? You know, Godzilla. <laughs> Godzilla got a facelift. Lord. I have never, I don't think people really take this like that. And it's been like, y'all, this has been my experience ever since I've been on here. And all I did was post a viral video. My first commentary went viral. It was getting, it was activity every second of the day. I had never seen nothing like it. And it has driven air all these folks crazy. Okay. Point blank period. Ah! 
Y'all, what should I do? Nah, I ain't gonna tell y'all. Cause they gonna be reading the comments and doing screenshots and everything else. Don't answer that. Don't answer the question. Y'all skin it out. Well, isn't that noble of her? It's called reporting and supporting. Hmm. But you know what? Karma, karma is that corkscrew all down in your damn brain. Your brain is like lumpy mashed potatoes right now. Help me get get a job get out that chamber get away from that man that random man where all is his hands and his foots and his fingers and his toes and his nose and all that different stuff where's all what is all where's all that going at night time and in the daytime and in between time Do he got you sniffing the crack of his ass, looking for cracks, crack to smoke, rocks, or crack rock in the crack of his ass? Yeah, fuck, because I'm sick of it. I bet you are. That you know, that has to be tough to just you know be just you know, <coughs> you know to just lay there and just be ravaged. Day and night by a complete stranger. Just to have a roof over your head. Garley. Now you know got the money no. Hot the money no. Us doesn't do that in the United States. Thank you. No. You need to watch your back. Watch your channels. Watch how people going to turn on your ass. You know. People from your camp are already sending me information about you. I'm not going to do nothing with it. Because I don't want no harm to come to you the way that you want harm to come to me. You know. But you don't deserve to be on YouTube. I know that for a fact. You know. And there's a lot of people that aren't going to rest until you're gone. All your channels. Gone. Because you're a horrid. You're a horrid half of a heifer. Bitch. And good night. Mm hmm with your ragu looking teeth, your ragu face. You got a damn ragu looking face. Hi, I'm a rag, just drag my face. My face been dragged all down Spaghetti Street. Kinda hole. Mm. And, you know, let's play hopscotch on my teeth, you know. Just jump from this step to the next step, then slide on round down here, you know. And then climb all these big old mountains and then come back down these valleys and then make it up here and then you can and then you can take the little sliding thing all around into this corkscrew that has driven me out of my mind. You know. You're so consumed with me. You know, that's why I, I make sure I do videos to reveal the true you, the true monster that you are. You suffer from psychosis, you know, you know, lack of B-I-G-R-E-D doses. <laughs>